That thing snores. It was okay. The sound was really busy. Do you never guess what happened? There was a Tesco and I bumped it to Charlotte, you know, my friend, my friend from back home. And she she told me that her sister Becky said that um do you remember do you remember um Emily, my ex boyfriend George? He was going out now with Laura and it's just the same as him. Same as her, sorry. And I just think I just feel so bad for Emily. Anyway, and Becca were talking about, about love and two people being together and, and she mentioned this thing about everlasting love and I, I was wondering like, you know, whether such thing exists and I don't know, do you believe in everlasting love? So what do you think? About what? About what? Did you ever listen to me? Sorry, sweetheart, sorry. Are you kidding me? Oh, forget it. I don't be like this. Like what? Not like this. Well, come on now, tell me what you said. Okay, well, I was thinking, we've been together now for five years, and mm -hmm. I was wondering whether... Yeah, go on. Well, I was wondering whether... Come on, it's better right. Will you marry me? <laughs> what? Are you serious? Hey, look, you can't ask me that. Why not? Because it's the man's job. Well, why don't you ask me then? Because I'm not ready. That's a no. Look, no, it's not a no. That's it's... a no. Look, no. I'll marry you one day, just not now. One day doesn't exist. What are you doing? So much for that special dinner. Hey, come on, sweetheart. Hey! Son, how you doing? Yeah, not too bad. Oh, what's up with you, son? Well, do you know we've been up with Trace now for five years? Yes. Yeah, well, she wants me to pop the question. Really? How would you know? Because she popped the question. You what? Get out of it. I'm serious. You're joking. Well, it's hell, the first time I've had a woman proposing to a fella. Yeah, me too. Did she, um, Get you a ring? No. Well, you still don't think so? And you said no. Well, I couldn't say yes, could I? Why not? Because she asked me. The only one I should, you know, pop the big question. So why didn't you? Because I'm not ready. Do you love her? Of course I do. No. Do you really love her? Yeah. She's my life, you so know. What are you waiting for? I'm waiting to get a pay rise. So I can buy her an amazing ring. And if all goes well, I'll get a promotion in about six months. Look, I'm sure she'd accept a plastic ring from you, mate. Whatever, I want to do it properly. Right. Fair enough, son. What one of these doing? You mean cheer you up? Not sure about that, Trev. It's only six months. Six months. Anyway, I'm uh, dash. Have fun at your shift. Take care, son. <laughs> You're never really good at that. What are you talking about, lad? I'm getting closer every day. Anyway, how are you doing? Pretty good, cheers. Really? How come? I mean, no, they've been really good against the law or anything. <laughs> I'll tell you some of this, son. Here, do you mind? Hey, uh, you're joking. What's up with you, lad? You'll find out soon enough. Really? Well, whatever it is, I like it. Get stuck in me. Alright, cheers, Trev. Good top, man. See you later. Hello, lad.
Sorry, who? Yeah, yes, yeah, speaker. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, I'm still here. 